Let's remove the leaves and then make it more high. Now a few branches would be nice. And let's decorate them a little bit. And a little bit more. We need an entrance and a house on the top. With balconies, leaves on the roof, a few stones underneath and something for decoration. I start by placing three ladders here for the entrance and then I create a few branches. As you can see each branch is one block higher from a previous one. Also I colored the ground to help you and me not get lost. Now I use trapdoors to decorate the branches. As you can see, I leave the front side of a few branches without a trapdoor. I place item frames with stone brick stair inside to simulate an arrow that shows the correct path. Using spruce fence and slabs, I decorate the branches a little bit. I make this pillar to help you stand when you climb the ladder, and then with spruce fence and stone brick slabs, I create a path to walk. Now it's time for the house. Place a ladder and a trapdoor on the top and then continue by placing spruce slabs on the lower level of the block. Extend the corners just like that. Now put spruce wood planks in the empty spots but not in the middle ones. Use grass for the rest. Place glass on the top of the other slabs and two in height. Now spruce planks on the top of the glass. Use spruce slabs to connect them in the middle, just like that. And now connect them on the corners. Use cobblestone wall with a spruce fence on the top to connect the floor with the roof. Place grass on the top to fill in this gap and make it more natural and then I use trapdoors on the corners to make it look more solid. Now for this balcony, extend the grass block by one and use upside down stone brick stairs left and right with a trapdoor. For the rest, do the same but replace the grass with stone brick slab. Now I use stone bricks in this specific spot, forming something like an upside down stair for decoration. Use cracked and mossy stone bricks in random spots to make it more interesting. With cobblestone wall and beach fence, make a pillar like this, followed by grass on the bottom to simulate a hanging flower pot. I leave one side without the trapdoor to make it more interesting. Break these two blocks and place bridge fence so you can have more space. Now let me guide you inside. 
So when I was designing this tree house, I knew that the birch tree is the smallest out of all. But again, I didn't want it a very small and low in height tree house. So I decided to keep the house small, but build it in a higher place and fill in the rest with decoration. For some reason, I find the taller tree houses more appealing. A note to keep in mind is that if you want to place a block on the floor, first lower the slab by half a block. So that was my beach treehouse design. Now if you want more like this, I have this video where I build a spruce treehouse. Anyway, thank you very much for watching and also I want to thank the people who support my channel all this time and I really hope that my designs have at least inspired you.